Welcome to the second video in our series on pediatric pharmacology. The drug, dexamethasone, is indicated for croup, asthma, and vasogenic cerebral edema. Side effects may include depression, headache, blurred vision, high blood pressure, tachycardia, fractures, reddening of the skin, poor wound healing, high blood sugar, bleeding, and low blood potassium levels. The dosage for croup is 0.6 milligrams per kilogram orally, intramuscular, or IV route for one dose, with a maximum dosage of 16 milligrams. The asthma dosage should be 0.6 milligrams per kilogram orally, intramuscular, or IV route every 24 hours per two doses with a max dose of 16 milligrams. The dosage for vasogenic cerebral edema is one to two milligrams per kilogram via IV or IO load. Diphenhydramine is indicated for anaphylactic shock and its side effects include dizziness, fatigue, blurred vision, low blood pressure, tachycardia, palpitations, chest tightness, nausea, diarrhea, urinary retention, photosensitivity, rash, anemia, anaphylaxis. The dosage is one to two milligrams per kilogram via IV, IO, or IM every four to six hours with a max dose of 50 milligrams. The drug dobutamine is used for congestive heart failure and cardiogenic shock. Side effects are anxiety, headache, high and low blood pressure, palpitations, nausea, vomiting, anemia, low blood platelet level, and chest tightness. The dosage is 2 to 20 micrograms per kilogram per minute via IV or IO infusion. Dopamine is a drug used to treat hypotension when the systolic blood pressure is between 70 to 100 millimeters of mercury, shock, and is also indicated for use after atropine administration for symptomatic bradycardia. Dopamine's contraindications are hypovolemia and cardiogenic shock with congestive heart failure. It should not be given with sodium bicarbonate. Side effects include tachydysarrhythmias, ventricular dysarrhythmias, and myocardial ischemia. The dosage is 2 to 20 micrograms per kilogram per minute. Epinephrine is indicated for various conditions including anaphylaxis, asthma, bradycardia, croup, pulseless arrest, hypotensive shock, and toxins or overdose. Side effects may include tremors, anxiety, labored breathing, arrhythmias, palpitations, tachycardia, high blood pressure, nausea, vomiting, renal vascular ischemia, and high blood sugar. The dosage for treating anaphylaxis is 0.01 milligrams per kilogram in the thigh every 15 minutes, or 0.01 milligrams per kilogram every three to five minutes via IV or IO route. For asthma, 0.01 milligrams per kilogram every 15 minutes. For bradycardia, 0.01 milligrams per kilogram every three to five minutes via IV or IO route. For croup, administer 0.25 milliliters of racemic solution with three milliliters normal saline inhaled by a nebulizer or three milliliters by an inhaled nebulizer. For pulseless arrest, 0.01 milligrams per kilogram every three to five minutes via IV or IO route. For hypotensive shock, 0.1 to one micrograms per kilogram per minute in an IV or IO infusion. For toxins or overdose, 0.01 milligrams per kilogram via IV or IO route. The drug ipotropium bromide is indicated for asthma and may cause side effects such as anxiety, dizziness, blurred vision, coughing, palpitations, nausea, vomiting, and rash. The dosage is 250 to 500 micrograms inhaled every 20 minutes for three doses. 
This concludes our second video on pediatric pharmacology. Please proceed to the next video to learn more.